everybody, my name is Dad Nico, and guys, welcome to a new Let's Play. Today guys, we'll be playing Life is Strange. Okay, so I do have to warn you guys now, I've tried to play through this once, and let's just say the recording kind of went all wrong. Let's just say two hours worth of video footage was just chopped up and ruined. A lot of my content was just messed up. So I'm gonna try this again. Probably gonna make the same amount of choices. Who knows, but anyway guys, welcome. I do have the first episode only. I will be getting the new episode very soon, I hope. And I'll get the rest of the pack. Hold on. Ugh, it was here. Alright, let's do this. storm. Famously called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Um... Okay, I do have to say this. I am in a photography class. It's a pretty good image. I really like it. I would have... lured out this, but at the same time... It looks pretty good. Looks really good. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. I can't she believe I still have this pencil case. Right? <laughs> I should upgrade to the 21st no! century. No! But I like it old school. No, never Seriously though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Oh, now I... Okay, last time I was here, I had no idea what the date was. Now I know what the date is, I think. Alright, let's do this. Um, you can pause if you guys want to read this. I'll probably look back and look at this. Um, do, 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 do. Wow. 2013. I was 13. Black Hole 6 
I have an ass load of homework. That's awesome. I like her humor. She, yeah, she's my age too. Alright, what's this? Max. Ooh. I did not know about this last time. Mac my name is Max Caulfield, and ever since I was a little kid, I wanted to be a photographer. I've always seen the world through my own lens finder. Maybe it's a way to be part of the world, but at a safe distance. For a reason, I'm always drawn to an old analog camera gear. Rather than digital tech, of all kinds of styles and techniques, but for me, the instant camera selfie is... Oh! Really? I don't care if people make fun of me or not, I'm in good company, right? And I've come all the way back to my childhood home to talk via Blackwell Academy, a private school for 12th grade seniors. Oh, so this is high school? This is like a high school? On a scholarship even. I originally left Chloe behind my best friend forever, at least until I left without talking to her once in five years. <laughs> Feel so weird to be back here without seeing her yet. So I'm 18 now, an official adult, even though I don't always feel wise and mature. I'm ready to begin my new life here in a retro camera, my style. Just say cheese. I do have to admit, I, I've only been 18 for a, while, a little bit, and I understand. Not only is Mark Deftion one of the fa f best photographers in the world, he's also my teacher. One of the reasons why I want to come to Blackwell Hall often do you. You get to be mentored by one of your inspirations. I've always loved his deco and goth style and his versatile with all of his incredible print and advertising work. Still, Jefferson can be a bit condescending. He's pretty hip for his age, but kind of aloof and sometimes persistent. He always has that smug smile when he thinks he's right. <laughs> I don't think he's preparing for us for tough as it is full-time artist. He acts like he understands my own work and obsession with analog images. He really wants me to enter a photo in this everyday heroes contest, but I've done a good job avoiding that. The winner gets to fly to San Francisco to represent Blackwell Academy, get a national exposure. I like to think my work could be good enough to win. I'm honored Jefferson even bugs about the contest. I've gotten if I ever seen Kate Marsh smile or laugh in the past month. She was really sweet and nice, even though the other. Students make fun of her obsessed companion, even if they act bit immature. Everybody at Blackwell are all seniors, <laughs> high school freshmen. She has a lot of shit, in fact. I know she's involved in a lot of religious groups, but she also doesn't preach to me, so I don't care. But she's given extra quiet and introverted the past couple weeks. She looks like she's in zombie mode. I wish I could help her, but I barely help myself. I wonder if all that bullying was worn her down. I can see how I would have to effort to make her more often invite her to tea or movies. Although she's an adult, I bet she's not allowed to watch rated R movies. <laughs> Pretty sure, uh, I don't want to read. Okay, is that it? So, picture. Oh, these are the episodes. Oh, these are places. And that's my phone. Okay. I'll capture you in a moment of desperation. I don't know why. I, just I do love to my do analog that. camera. I should take it. Isn't my that little true? camera bag is battered, but still Problems. kicking. What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of their beauty or innocence? I don't know. She had a brilliant eye. So, she could have taken... Shh, shh. I believe Max Crap. has taken what you kids call a selfie. I still think a selfies dumb word are so for stupid. a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Sure. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie, selfie expression. expression. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't resist. I don't think so. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. <laughs> now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? <sighs> Um, I'm gonna try the other option. You're asking me? Let me think. L let me think. Um. You either know this Damn or it. not, Matt. So either way, he'd still Is be upset. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Damn it. Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally <coughs> stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Shut up, you. Bitch. Very good, Victoria. Bitch. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces. 
making them extremely popular from the 1800s. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Oh, do, 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 do I not get to... Well, fine. fine. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your, in your textbook. textbook. Or even online. Oh, really hey guys, don't it. forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, Max yeah, I, I see, see you pretending, pretending not to see me. <laughs> That's me. Okay, so... All right, let's take another. I already know some of the photos stop. Oh, I want to. This thing is still crazy. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Uh, it's still expensive camera. I know how like expensive cameras are. That's like two thousand dollars more expensive than cameras I'm used to seeing. I just worked so hard in the shop, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. Oh, Victoria. Wow. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. Now I, I see what you mean. Okay. So, is, is this pictures I need to take? I guess we gotta find out. It's an important cultural event, and I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by participating. Spick. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse, Excuse you. you. No, Victoria. Bitch. Excuse us. I'd no, never let one of photography's future Victoria. stars avoid handing in her picture. I did have any. I don't like to use that. Do I have to? Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. <laughs> now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude, dude lecture you. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 blah. right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. God, that's, that speech still gives me fucking goosebumps. All right, now I'm half tempted to read about Victoria. Then there's Victoria Chase, the elite of Blackwell Academy, and a total bitch. Uh huh. I hate saying that, and I don't know why someone who's so rich and beautiful needs to be so fucking mean. 18 years old, a presentious, I can talk, I swear. Academy should be evolving artists and scholars, not reality show contestants. <laughs> Victoria does everything for maximum drama. She actually wastes her time calling me out in class and taunting Kate Marsh. Yeah, someone needs to get a life. Someone stop treating people like crap. For reals, I wish her parents could see her in action. They cut cut off that trust fund fast. Then again, she's in a vortex club. They seem to own the school, so maybe that's why she doesn't give a shit. The other thing is that she does no art and photography. She can even say all those French names that break my tongue. Her work's a little cold, but has a good eye. She has an eye for Mr. Jefferson, which is obviously that I'm embarrassed for her. She does everything to sit in his lap. Ugh. Keeps his distance, though. We can all tell she's trying to win the Everyday's Hero Contest. I'm sure it drives her crazy. That's somebody she can't buy or seduce. That is creepy. Why would you do that? Jesus Christ, that's creepy. That is really... I'm honestly creeped out right now. Ugh. I didn't even read that last time. I forgot I could look in that. Whoops. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. You, feel like you, have you always Welcome to the real world. Just cute? Hot. Then I might send you a special picture. I heard that entire conversation. I'm not paying She plays it so sharp. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Same. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like hey. a total loser. Hey, honey. You look fabulous the way you are. My, my style is just a little unique. That's the best way She's I can so explain shy. my sense of style. It's unique. It's not like the unique they call the bullshit nowadays. But definitely different. Always a different taste every day. Depends on what I feel. Do 
don't text and drive. Sure. There's still shift. Damn it. Nope. Still haven't learned shift. I already talked to all these people. Oh. I didn't realize Stella was right there. I didn't look at Stella. Stella is always deep in her notes. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. Uh, I don't think anybody wrote this place, uh, but apparently- Oh! I didn't read the poster. Ugh. I wish October would last forever. Save October is amazing! Stop bullying now! Sure, that's gonna scare people into it. I thought that's gonna get people's attention. Everything. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for so me. So I kinda know what's going on. Like lost laptops and all that. So probably I can get things faster. I think the uh eh, eh sink. Sink. Thank you. I want the damn sink. <laughs> uh, I'll probably make this episode a little longer than normal. Just to give you guys a taste. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Um. Fuck it. Oh no. Oh. oh. My chest hurts. When a door closes, a window opens, or something like that. I don't know, but whoever put that little writing up okay, there... Okay, bro, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Oh my god, that is such a pretty butterfly. I do have to admit, that is really pretty. But you have to say, whoever put this... on there was great. What? Oh, there's another poster I didn't see? Jesus. Good thing I went through this. This poster must drive people to have sex. Uh, absence makes a heart grow f Um, Kate twerks for... God, you can still love and learn without sex. Time is on your side, so use common sense. Okay, I was kind of creeped out for a second right there. Wait, why do I worry about the fire bell? I remember when somebody punked the alarm last month. Really? At least I got out of science class for that quiz. True. Let's take a photo of the pretty butterfly. The beautiful butterfly. I miss analog cameras. I miss them. They were fun. Played was a lot when I was a kid. And oh shit. Why is there a dude in the boys girls bathroom? Get the fuck out of here, dude. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't uh, stress. You, you're uh, okay, bro. Just come to three. I thought I was crazy. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> You're the boss. Uh, you sure about that? You fucking asshole. So what do you want? <gasps> I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. Hella That's cash. my family, I love not it. me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. Oh God. I can tell everybody Nathan Man. Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Uh, 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 what are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people so trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, no! Oh, no. Shit just went down. Oh, my God. Uh, okay. Did you say that? Whoa. What the fuck? What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Jesus Christ. These pieces of time can frame us in our I already world. heard this lecture. From light to shadow. shadow. From color. Now to Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. Can you give me an example of a photo? I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Oh my god. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller, 
Can I actually reverse time? Um, Why are they? Think? Because of her images of. I feel better now. I did it. Can you I actually an did it. A photographer uh -huh. who perfectly <gasps> matched me. Black and white. Yes, yes, we are. Anybody? Beautiful. Next. Don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why when I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Yep. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. Uh -huh. know it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation. So I can go back in time. Uh -huh. Selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point Can I save that her? The portraiture has always Maybe. been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our in okay, uh, I feel sick. I have to use the bathroom. Especially, I want to say this. I want to say I feel sick. Mm, I feel sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. Damn it! We can talk more after class. Fuck! Is there anybody oh, shit. who knows their Jefferson stuff? wants to keep me after Lilith class. Was a French and I need time to save that girl. No kidding. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Fuck you. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. So what if I rewind it and give him the right answer? Okay. Let's do this. The Daguerrean process. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Yay! The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Uh, Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Okay, so guys, Max, I'm gonna cut it here. you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. Okay, well thank you guys so much for watching, leave a like, leave a favor, leave a comment, and guys, I'll see you guys next video. Dark Neko out.